hey guys so i know i haven't posted in quite some time and this time it's been pretty long um i keep doing these videos of like where i come back finally but um i think this is it i think this is the one um i have a little bit of a life update i guess you can say so i took advantage uh i think the last time i posted a video i think i was going to my sister's in virginia that was two years ago currently my baby is sleeping so uh i gotta keep looking at the monitor make sure he doesn't he doesn't crawl away because he's at the crawling stages um and he's not a slow crawler he's a super fast crawler so i gotta be quick um so he's he's currently seven months uh, he's gonna be eight months in two days. Uh, he was born in November um, on Thanksgiving Day, actually, the 25th. Uh, so that was super exciting. So last year, I went to my sister's wedding in March. I found out I was pregnant around April, maybe. Um, and then maybe I'll post a little video of like how that went um because that's a whole different video but so yes um i did have a baby i am still at my parents house my boyfriend husband is with us as well um he we actually have a house um that's maybe like an hour away but because it is far it's actually an hour and 30 minutes uh away from la um it's so it's kind of hard to travel from there to here when he works so um we actually just stay at my parents house during the week and then on the weekend we go to our house we are currently in the works of getting another house um closer to my parents house and to his family because where we have the house now there's no one really close by uh I said I had a baby, a uh, baby boy, baby Luca, Luca, L-U-C-A. Uh, a lot of people say Lucas or Lucas. It's not with an S, uh, it's just Luca. I did stop working. I stopped working actually around August of last year, um, only because, again, this is for like another pregnancy video that I probably, I am going to make only because I think it would be nice to share my experience as a first time mom. And um, that sounds exciting actually. So I th that's gonna be in the works. Um, oh, well, I did start working last year in August. One, because I did go to Mexico with my, my husband. So we went to Mexico in August to visit his parents. In August, we were there for maybe about, I don't know, maybe like, um, I want to say like a month. I think we were there for like a month. The trip was only supposed to be, I believe, two weeks and a half. And we ended up staying there three and a half. Uh, so we had to actually cancel our ticket to come back and then get another ticket. Um, so we did that. And then that was pretty fun. I turned five months pregnant when I was over there. Um, weather was hot, humid uh maybe i entered some pictures or videos that i took that when we were there um uh, maybe a belly uh a belly picture um so then there was that and well when i found out that i was pregnant uh obviously you make an appointment and all that and so i went to uh get everything checked out and make sure everything was okay or they gave me some news about me and um it was kind of like a I don't know. I guess you could say it did scare us. It scared us. Um, we did shed a tear or two. Um, but in the end, everything worked out. We left everything in God's hand. So everything turned out fine, perfect. Um, and so that's the reason why I uh, stopped working. So my husband didn't want me to uh, stress out too much. So there's that. Um, I did stop baking for some time, which actually yesterday was the first day that I started. Um, I let everybody know that I would be taking orders. Um, I don't want to stress out too much, 
to um do orders only because i'm still getting the hang of luca's schedule um we don't have a set schedule so we're just gonna plan it by year um and if i do take orders it'll be orders that i know i'm able to do um on his time um and i say on his time because it's literally on his time now is uh pretty good at taking naps sometimes um so i do kind of have more time uh during the day maybe um so that i'm able to do other things um so right now what i started doing was also um cake toppers and um that is pretty fun i like doing that only because um i get to be a little bit creative um with my hands and i'm very hands-on so that's good um and so like i said i started baking yesterday and i let everybody know that i would be taking orders again um and i guess you could say i kind of work like um like actually work on things that get sold um because well like i said i do cake toppers for the bakery um and if you guys ever want a cake topper you guys can let me know and i can do that for you i could you know um you guys can pick it up or i could ship it to you either way uh so there's that and so yes that's the reason why i stopped i stopped working for that and then i started working from home once i figured out that he started taking naps during the day um because i knew that i would have a little bit of time in between so that i can get stuff done um so there's that so i already said i got i had a baby um i went to mexico i stopped working um i started working <laughs> started working from home i do cake toppers i'm gonna start doing cakes um mainly gonna want to focus on cakes and cupcakes um maybe cake pops maybe cake pops maybe rice krispies maybe pretzel sticks we'll figure that out later um only because cake pops take a really long time to do cake pops are one thing that i will be trying to figure out if i do or not um if you guys have any uh i don't know questions maybe if you have any questions uh if you have any questions that you may want to ask you guys can ask um i just hope that we can we can make this this uh we can make this 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 channel grow because i've had it for a couple years now um and it's time it's time to start dedicating myself to doing more things um again i do have a baby so it's a little complicated but we're trying to figure it out especially when you want to do something i know that you're going to motivate yourself to do what you want to do so my goal and i'm going to say it here my goal is to grow this channel i also started to um kind of uh collect uh these things called dorables um they are little characters that um they're disney characters i think they have one of disney characters i think i've seen one of lilo and stitch so i've been collecting those i've been going to target and buying them and collecting them maybe i buy more and then make like because i still have a few to collect so maybe i buy more and then do like an opening on here and then uh upload that um but because you do get repetitive like characters sometimes i decided to make keychains with them so i would also be selling those but let me let me go get it and then i'll be right back so i think you guys already saw it you guys i put it on the screen um but so these are the adorables uh i put them in a ziploc bag because i had nowhere else to put them so these are the ones that I've already collected. As you guys can see, it's the little ch it's chip, uh, the tiger from, um, what's the name of that one? Uh, something book, I forgot. The Jungle Book, so that's that one. The Chameleon from uh, Tangled. We got uh, the little, the sun from um, The Incredibles, Dash we've got uh 
I forgot what his name, Doug, is that his name? From um, Up, and the little chunky guy from Up is over here. Uh, this guy's from Sleepy, no, not Sleepy Beauty. <sighs> from Beauty and the Beast. Uh, I forgot what his name was as well. Sleepy Beauty. <laughs> We've got the octopus. Um, this is actually a yellow octopus. It has, um, I think it's two different octopus. So like the original, which is orange. And then this yellow one, which is like a special edition. Uh, we got the frog from um, Princess of the Frog. Uh, we got a Mickey Mouse in there. We got another chameleon. So chameleon also had a special edition. Oh, there goes Belle. We've got Belle in the house. We got a uh, beast. Baby, 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 is it baby JJ? I forgot what his name was. Um, uh, the cat ha the cat from uh, Alice in Wonderland. So there's a few in here that I've collected. Oh, there's the dodo bird. There's um, Frozen, uh, Olaf, Anna, and Elsa. And so this is what I was making. Little keychains to sale they're ready to go um i just haven't posted them anywhere yet because i want to collect a few things um then i'll post them to my because i have an instagram account that i've created for uh my crafts which are like these um the cake toppers um i want to do like little party favor ideas as well uh, but we'll see so for now it's just this and cake toppers so this is what i have been making um we got olaf here we've got sleeping beauty uh we've got from inside out we've got um who was this angry no not angry what emotion was she i forgot oh no digest this is digest yeah, Digest. That was Digest. And then we got the dad from The Incredibles. This, his eyes are a little wonky. I'm not sure. So I was debating whether to do this one or the other one. But his eyes are a little wonky. But it's okay. Um, so yeah. And I added these like little tassels just to like, I don't know, make it look a little more fancy, I guess. And I do... So I do have a bunch of these. Um, I could sell it. Like for example, this one, obviously, I don't know, maybe a, a guy would like it, maybe, maybe not. But in case that a guy likes it and doesn't want the tassel, you guys could let me know and then I could take the tassel off. Um, or yeah, take the tassel off and then I could just sell you the beads and the character. Well, everything minus the tassel. Uh, same thing with all the other ones. So like if you don't like the tassel, I could take the tassel off. It's not that hard um, But yeah, so these are the These are the keychains that I had been working on because I said what what am I gonna do with all these dorables that are like, you know um, Copies um, I have no idea what I'm gonna do with those um, and I don't want them just sitting around. So, like, why not give them a new home? Uh, let's sell them. Let's see what we can sell. Uh, and then, yeah, they could have a new home. So, there's that. Uh, I've also made those. I will be posting those soon onto my Instagram page. The only thing is that I am waiting to find, find like a backdrop that I could use so that I could take pictures of my cake toppers and also those keychains. And um, yeah, I haven't gone to the store to get one yet. I'm thinking of just doing a whiteboard. So we're gonna do that. Uh, but I do have to go to the store and find one first. That is my little mini life update. Uh, maybe not too exciting for me, it is. A lot of things are in the works right now. So uh, just give me some time and I'll uh, put everything out. Uh, I will put my Instagram account on the description below. Um, and just go ahead and make sure and share this video with your friends and family. Um, 
make sure to subscribe and like i said let's grow this channel guys let's grow this channel because i've had it for some time i know i've been a little uh lazy on making videos for it but we're here and this time i think we're here to stay um and um yeah we're here to stay so let's uh like this video let's share it and subscribe and let me know what else you guys would like to hear what you guys like to see so with that being said guys uh thanks for listening to my ted talk <laughs> just kidding thanks for uh listening to my life update i mean the life update um i do uh plan on making more videos for you guys so um for now i'll see you guys later and again don't forget to like subscribe and go down in the description below and um go ahead and follow my instagram because i do have those uh few instagrams that i'm going to post my crafts to baking stuff and then well my personal account so i'll go ahead and i'll link those down below um but yeah have a good day guys bye